What is up? This is your LA in a minute. And unfortunately, all this food is getting thrown away in my house today. Part of 8 million pounds of food that get thrown away every day in Los Angeles. Sometimes it's because it's stale or it went bad or people don't want leftovers. They just don't want to deal with it. But this is a major problem in Los Angeles. So how did we get to this point and what are we doing about it? Let's get into it. So I want to repeat that number. 8 million pounds of food is thrown away every day in Los Angeles. That means almost every person in the county throws away a pound of food every day. Sheesh. That's $200 per person per month. Dinner scraps, leftovers, spoiled fruit and veggies, so-called expired items. That is a lot of waste from your pocketbook too. 40% of all food in Los Angeles ends up here. The biggest culprit, by the way, is Thanksgiving. No shock. We're in LA alone. 30 million pounds of food valued at $40 million went into the wastebasket. So those are huge numbers as far as trash thrown away by individuals. But grocers are also responsible for 30% of the food waste. And this isn't blaming grocers or stores because food loss can happen at any stage of the process between farm and retail. I mean, there's spoilage during drying, milling, transportation. Sometimes foods just go bad and they have to be tossed. And keep in mind, consumers aren't willing to buy foods that are near their expiration date or fruit or vegetables that don't look nearly perfect. Also in Los Angeles and elsewhere, food waste emits methane as it decomposes, which is terrible for the atmosphere. So Los Angeles is kind of taking the lead to eliminate food waste. There was a law passed called Senate Bill 1383 that requires consumers to compost, and they're even handing out these little green bins to every household to kind of facilitate the process. So 1383 requires cities and other jurisdictions to divert the organic waste from landfills. Perhaps more importantly, it requires that 20% of the edible food currently being thrown away be redirected to people in need. So on that note, there's a few organizations that do good work as far as reducing food waste. Feeding America is one of them. They focus on reducing food waste in farms, food service, retail. And over their lifespan nationwide, they've rescued 3.6 billion pounds of groceries. Wow. What's also cool is up in Silmar, the Sunshine Canyon landfill, there's a biogas facility that turns food waste into natural gas for heating and electricity. So 8 million pounds of food trash per day in Los Angeles is a huge issue. And I'm part of the problem. But at least we know the city's working on some programs to minimize that number. Now it's just up to me and you to make sure that we don't waste that food. All right, LA, it's been a minute.